And back with us here on Nets Hot Stove. Amidst all the talk about whether Brooklyn should acquire a third star, they might already have him on the roster. While Karis LeVert may not have a lock on a starting role, he's ready to contribute in whatever way he can. With my game, I'm kind of versatile, and I could play with the ball, play without the ball. Um, you know, start, come off the bench, whatever it may be, I feel like I can adjust, um, and I can play pretty much any role that, you know, I'm put in. So, for me, like I said, I'm just excited to get out there and contribute um, to wins in any way possible. So, you know, if that's starting, if that's coming off the bench, um, Steve and I will talk more about it. But um, I think everyone's main goal right now is winning basketball games and, you know, putting us in the best position to do so. I have a suspicion that this is going to be uh, like a continually um, evolving season where – Injuries, COVID, um, the, the density of the schedule will present all sorts of different opportunities for us, but not necessarily by design, if you know what I mean. So I, I don't think it's going to be like, well, we'll start, you know, uh, whoever, Joe for five games and then Spencer for five, then Karis for five. I think it's a scenario where we're going to figure it out as we go. Laverne has improved his scoring average every year he's been in the league, and he took a major step forward last season, becoming one of six guards in the East to average at least 18 points, four rebounds, and four assists. His scoring average was five points higher than during the 2018-2019 season, and he was especially dominant at the NBA campus in Orlando. I remember, Frank, we were talking about this last game yeah. of the season when they were knocked out by Toronto in terms of what's the best role for Karras. What do you feel it may be? I I think on this team, I think coming off the bench would be great for him because this way the ball will be in his hands. You know, think about that game that he had against the Boston Celtics right before the shutdown. I mean, on the road against a terrific team, he was absolutely dominant. And I think to Steve Nash's point, let's remember now, Kevin Durant is coming back from a significant injury. So he's not going to play all 72 games. So there's going to be plenty of times where Karis LeVert will be inserted into the starting lineup. And there is nothing wrong with coming off the bench. A lot of players, the big thing is, are you finishing the game? And I think a lot of nights he will be finishing the game and let's remember Kevin McHale starts six man uh, Mano Ginobili's going to go into the Hall of Fame mostly came in off the bench really it's about you know getting shots getting minutes and Karis LeVert is going to get his share of that especially on this team where this season everything is up for grabs who knows how many games guys will miss it's going to be a short amount of time to play 72 games he'll be out there he's going to be a big part of this team yeah having a Ginobili role is not a bad thing at all let's stay